All right, folks, now here on the river again. I'm in the Yak and I'm up, up the river from uh, York Hill. And I'm in a, I got a pretty good size hole back here, one of the deeper parts up this river. So we want to see if there's anything hiding out there that's, that's wanting to eat some gizzard shad. That's all I've got. So I'm going to cut up some gizzard shad. Throw it back there and see if there's anything in there wanting to eat. Feels like he might be. Not too bad. I've got a bite on every one except for the one that's on the far left. A little bite. At least I do have my net out this time. Oh. Pretty good blue. Fish never decided to fight till you got right here at the boat. I thought I might have had a log hung up. some of this stuff out of my way. Blue. It's probably about 10, 11. Channel. Been messing with it for a little bit. We don't cross that other one. It's coming toward the boat now.
Pretty good old male kennel. channel how wide and big his head is there Dink channel. Another male channel. Dang old sheet flies or deer fly just keep buzzing around my head and the things will bite the heck out of you. I need to catch me a bat and train it, let him hang right there. Till that thing's flying around and fly off of there and catch him for me. I'll have to do that. I'll check in the attic, see if there's any up there. Get a little one while I'm training. I think I'm gonna reel these in and try a different spot. I've caught some fish here, but no giants. Let's see if I can go catch some something bigger. All right, I got a new spot. Let's see what happens here. I've marked a lot of fish. Let's see what they are.
first one of them I've ever caught in this river. Striped bass. First one of them I ever caught in this river. channel all right folks that's it for today it's three o'clock i've been out here baking in the sun but um not a bad day caught several fish nothing big caught my first striper ever in this river and it's only the i think the fifth striper i've ever caught in my life i caught three one day when i was about 18 or 19 we went to falls lake me and my cousin we caught three each and I caught one year before last a Lake Tillery a small one and that one is the first one I've ever even seen in this river I've heard of them being in here in High Rock but it's the first one I've ever saw but productive day filleted all those fish up probably got 10 12 pounds of catfish and uh, striper fillet so pretty soon I'm gonna have a fish fry um, river still muddy has some flow in it I found this hole right here. I've seen that hole coming up the river and it looks like the water's churning all the time. And I thought there was a pipeline, a gas pipeline that went across the river here because there's a sign right there. <clears throat> it says danger do not anchor right here where I'm anchored. But uh, I always thought it was the gas line, but it's not the AT&T line, K1. Um, but, it's about eight foot deep right here. When you get right there where that water's swirling, it, it's a, like a four or five foot deeper for a little bit. And when I went over that with the fish finder, it was stacked with fish. So we caught, caught some uh, channels and that striper. I know there's a bunch of gar in there. I could tell by the bait. But um, there's a carp, he just jumped over there. So there was fish in there and uh, had a productive day. But um, still gonna, waiting on those huge ones again and uh they may be right at night they might be in the earlier in the morning but uh but to try it again maybe tomorrow evening hope you enjoy the video and i'll be back out here as soon as i can